for all we might say of Hemingway and, and women, he had his heart broken more than once. Uh, and of course, that's, that's also reflected um, in his novels. But Corey, let me get you to read, let me get you to read a particularly heartbreaking one. Uh, 30th of March, 1919. And this is, this is, to, uh, this is to his friend uh, Bill Horn. Yeah. Caro amico. It's kind of hard to write it, Bill, especially since I've just heard from you about how happy you are. So I'll put it off a bit. I can't write it, honest to God. It's hit me so sudden. So I'll tell you everything I know first. And then he goes on to sort of give news about their old friends back mm -hmm. home. He says, now, having failed miserably at being facetious, I'll tell you the sad truth, which I've been suspecting for some time since I've been back, and which culminated with a letter from Ag this morning. She doesn't love me, Bill. She takes it all back. A mistake. One of those little mistakes, you know. Oh, Bill, I can't kid about it, and I can't be bitter because I'm just smashed about it. And the devil of it is that it wouldn't have happened if I hadn't left Italy. For Christ's sake, never leave your girl until you marry her. I know, I know you can't learn about women from me, just as I can't learn from anyone else, but you, meaning the world in general, teach a girl. No, I won't put it that way. That is, you make love to a girl, and then you go away. She needs somebody to make love to her. And if the right person turns up, you're out of luck. That's the way it goes. You won't believe me just as I wouldn't. But Bill, I've loved Ag. She's been my ideal. And Bill, I forgot all about religion and everything else because I had Ag to worship. Well, the crash of smashing ideals was never merry music to anyone's ears. But she doesn't love me now, Bill. She's going to marry someone, name not given, whom she's met since. Marry him very soon, and she hopes that after I've, for, after I've forgiven her, and I will start and have a wonderful career in everything. But Bill, I don't want a wonderful career in everything. No, that isn't really fair. She didn't write, and everything. <laughs> All I wanted was ag and happiness. And now the bottom has dropped out of the world, and I'm writing this with a dry mouth and a lump in the old throat, and Bill, I wish you were here to talk to. The dear kid. I hope he's the best man in the world. Oh, Bill, I can't write about it, because I do love her so damn much. 